Hey guys, thanks for joining me today. So I think I posted a few weeks ago this um, Elf haul that I purchased. Elf had their 50% off sale and I purchased a bunch of things and um, subscriber Joyce Richards 04 asked that I do a eye look with one of the palettes that I purchased and just kind of review and talk about the shadows. So I have filmed the eye look for you and this is kind of what I came up with. It's just kind of just a neutral eye. Um, I've kind of used some golds and purples and grays. But um, this is the palette. It is the e.l.f. Neutral Eye Palette. It was $6 and I believe with the 50% off it was $3. So you get an array of shades um, ranging from matte to shimmer to satin. 32 um, shades in here. So not a bad price for 32 eyeshadows. As far as my thoughts on these goes, e.l.f., I feel like their palettes always have some really nice shadows, and then they have um, shadows that are just kind of duds. I'm swatching some for you. So there's some of the shadows. As you can see, the metallic shadows show up really well. They're really pretty. They're pigmented. Um, the matte shades, though, are the ones that are typically the duds. So, if I can get my hand right. So, there you go. You can see some of the shimmer. The shimmer ones have really nice color quality payoff. And, in fact, that's kind of what I used today. Um, your shadows that are like your mattes, I'll swatch some of the mattes. The mattes are just, for instance, here's the shade here. This is what I started out with on my lid. I mean, there's nothing there. There's just no color. Um, some of them do, but they're kind of chalky. So I would say that, um, you know, the mattes are kind of misses on this palette. Um, the shimmer, they have great quality. Um, you do have some satin, let me get some of these satins for you, the satin grays, that have decent quality, but as you can see, those are three separate shades, and they pretty much look the same. So, if you're looking for a palette to start out with, like a beginner palette of just neutral colors, this might be a really good um, option for you. There's 32 colors that you've got golds, bronze, grays, creams, you even have a really nice black, which the black is very black, but it's also very chalky. Um, so, it was $3. It's not, not a horrible palette. I do like the look that I have going on today. Um, you know, if you're traveling, it might be just a really simple, easy palette to just pack with you to make do. Um, by no means is it a horrible palette, so, but it's not. That's just quickly my thoughts on the palette itself. $3, 32 shades. I would say half of them are good quality or decent quality. A couple are duds, and then you have some that they're just fine. So nothing I'm overly enthused with. Um, but hey, it's $3. So... Anyways, I have filmed um, the eye look I'm wearing. I kind of did my lips and everything, too. So I will post that right after this so you can see my thoughts. So if you want to see the look that I got, I'm just going to use tuned. the e.l.f. Neutral Eye Palette. Um, here's a closer look if you didn't see it before. It's just got some neutral shades. I already have my face makeup done. I have my foundation, concealer, blush, did my brows, all that. So I would just do the eyes. Um, in case you're wondering what foundation I'm wearing, I'm using the L'Oreal Magic Nude Liquid Powder. I'm absolutely loving this foundation. It's made my July favorites. Um, I've pretty much worn it every day. So, anyway, so that's done. Let's start on the eye look. So, I think I'm just going to do probably just a natural, everyday eye look. Um, I don't know, though. We'll see. First, I'm going to um, prime my eyes. I'm going to use the Chella highlighter. So I'm just going to smooth that out all over my eye.
I'm going to get a flat shader brush in with, I'll probably do a combination of this matte taupe color and this one here. Let's start with this one. I'm just going to brush that all over my lid. I think with most e.l.f. palettes and shadows, you get some shadows that are just beautiful, really pigmented, and then you get some shadows that are kind of a dud. I would say this, this matte shade, there's not a lot of color to it. And I am going to go a little bit darker. I'm going to go in with this like satin gray color here. Maybe that will liven up that color on my eye. For the first, you can see it's just a very light application. And, I'm going to um, take a mixture of this almost just like I don't know, goldish, purplish looking color, um, and this darker color here. They both have, they both, both have purple undertones. Y'all, I can't talk today. And I'm just going to take that and just start going into the crease with this color. I'm not one of those people, as you can probably tell, that does one eye all the way and then goes back and does the other eye. I just kind of do them both at the same time. So I've got that darker color in. I'm just going to go in with a buffing brush and just buff them out. I'm going to use my MAC 217 for that. Just kind of soften that line a little. Angle brush. Let's get a fun color. I'm going to go in with this gold color right there. I am just going to take a little bit. I don't want this to be too gold. So let's just take a little and just kind of pop that over the top. We'll just give it another good buff one more time. And then we'll go in with um, one of their highlight shades, which would be probably just one of these matte shades. Um, there is actually a shimmer. So what I'll do is I'll go in with partial shimmer and then partial matte too, so we can just set it. I, I don't like when I've got a look of like shimmer and matte and then like the highlights just all shimmer or all matte. I'm weird, I know. So there you go, there's just a quick little look, um, an eye look with, it's just, it's just not neutral shades. It's not the greatest palette in the world. Um, it does have some really pretty colors in it, but like I said, some of them are just kind of duds. It's not bad eyeshadow look though. I mean, just, so there we have the eyes. eyes. It's just, like I said, just a simple eye look, nothing super intensive. You could wear this to work, you can wear it every day if you want. It's just a very simple look with the palette. I'm going to use the Barely Bitten, can you see that? Um, this is the Barely Bitten Elf 
mineral lipstick. And then, I love this little thing. This is also by Bourjois. It's the Bourjois 3D Effect Lip Gloss. It's just this tiny little lip gloss that had like a little string and you could attach it to your cell phone. I just like it. I like adding it just a little bit to the center of my lips. So just a little bit of so There you have it. There's the look. Just a simple, quick look with the palette, um, the e.l.f. Neutral Eye Palette. I had no clue what I was going for when I um, put this on. Just thought I would film something for you. So Joyce Richards 04, thank you for asking for this tutorial. And if there's ever a tutorial um, on any product I feature that you want to see or um, a review, just let me know. I'm happy to do it. So thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.